do you want your face on the front page of your website? Maybe not. But if you want to know how to add a video background to your WordPress website, you have come to the right place. If you want to add a video background by the default way, you can do it using Gutenberg's cover block. Let's just pick this one and let's just remove the filter to none. Yeah, that's good. Now we can replace the media by opening the media library or you can use upload if you want to. So I'm just going to pick one from the library and we're going to click the video background shot and select. And this is it. Literally, this is it because there are not many customization options. And we like customizing things because we want our website to feel different than other websites. And that's why, let me show you, PostX. PostX is the number one Gutenberg-based plugin to dynamically create news magazine site or any kind of blog. So make sure that you have the PostX plugin installed and activated on your site. To create a video background, we're gonna have to use the row column block of PostX. Now we need to select the layout. It's all according to your preference. You can select the layout now and if you're unsatisfied, you can even change it later. So don't worry about that. Now let's adjust the height with respect to the resolution of our video. Now from the background and the wrapper section, select video and insert the link of the video. That's the great thing about the row column block. You can not only display the video from your media library, but you can also display videos from a video hosting website through the links. Unlike the cover block of Gutenberg, the row column block of PostX is highly customizable. You can change the number of columns, change the layout, column gap, row gap, background overlay, spacing, border, space dividers, and so much more. The possibilities are infinite. You can even insert other blocks within the row column block. You can insert a search bar or any other Gutenberg blocks or your favorite PostX blocks. Here we have PostX's search block within PostX's row column block. We're gonna change the background to a video. I'm gonna select the row column then head over to the background in the wrapper section and select video. We're gonna insert the link of the video. Then we can make it into a loop. We can insert the start time and the end time as well. If you want, you can even add a video fallback image. Now let's see how it looks in the front end. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below.